Hello, everybody, and this is a quick reminder to let you know that you'll be able to catch today's match broadcast live on our club's FM station. Well, good evening wherever you are on this most pleasant evening. Hello, As you can and see, there's been a, a terrific atmosphere here. There is great expectation, excitement, and it has built nicely in these idyllic conditions. Conditions which are certainly playing their part in creating a glorious ambience. It's quite a struggle to get in here. Points of access hard to come by and an awful lot of people gathering to get through the gates. But regardless of that, there's a great feel here and much excitement for the game ahead. This is the gladiatorial arena that is the Stadio Olimpico, for so long the symbol of Rome's grand sporting history. And we rise now for the Danish national anthem. Well, that has got the juices flowing, and now this. There are plenty looking forward to seeing this, a capacity crowd here. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. the way oh that's a key interception no he's taken off it that's really well played oh good spread gets away from his opponents 
Oh, it's played into the area. Could move up a gear here. Jota. Octavio. Chance for the header! Decent enough try. Cristiano Ronaldo must have been hit by a flash of doubt then. He complicated what looked like an easy opportunity. Oh, he's managed to pinch it off him. Back in possession and ready to go again. Jota. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, denied brilliantly! Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Jao Cancelo spots it and intercepts. And here's the chance to counter. Octavio. Oh, it's come loose. Look at the space here. Oh, it's Octavio. Tries a header! Keeper pulls up a fine save. Joe Cancelo simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. <laughs> Massive leap! He's missed, but not by that far. Cristiano Ronaldo certainly could have and should have made more of that. Jota. Good driving run. He's found a way through. And it's played into the middle. Great leap! Goal! Portugal! That looks like a preconceived plan. Win the ball and then unleash. The goal scorer for Portugal after 16 minutes is number seven. Cristiano Ronaldo! <laughs> Portugal draw first blood here. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. He's shifting through the gears here. Bruno Fernandes. Header! And it's in! And again, they simply do not know what has hit them. Well, we've seen the hunger to win it back and the focus to make it count. A very tasty combination. Portugal take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from... And that's clear-cut, it's a free kick.
Well, he can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon. One wrong move now, and he's in trouble. Oh, that's a vigorous challenge. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Cristiano Ronaldo driving on and making good progress. He's left his man. Jota. Jota with the cross. Now the counter. Now it's Paulson. Oh no, no circumventing this opponent. The referee's awarded a free kick. Well, that looks like a final warning. Still no card. was wonderful in every regard vision concept and considerable accuracy look it goes against your pride and your professionalism to admit when Number something's 10. too good but that was just Erickson. unstoppable Denmark get themselves back into contention. Listen, goals change games, and that has changed the whole complexion of this one. They have the momentum now. Oh, it's Cristiano Ronaldo! It's Cristiano Ronaldo! That's a fine save! Cristiano Ronaldo really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Portugal corner number two then And now a sudden chance to counter Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo Physical challenge. Ruben Neves. Lovely ball into space. So, what can they make of this for Paulson? Paulson! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Portugal can start a counter here. Bernardo Silva powering forward here. Well, that is a good challenge from him. Hoiberg. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo. Now then, the balls come loose. And that's aimed into the middle. Oh, 
Trust in again. And the goalkeeper's got a good palm to that. And they've got it back as chance! It's loose, and the follow-up. And somehow it stayed out. Ericsson. Ruben Neves stands tall and stands strong. And there's his chance to lead the counter. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Bruno Fernandes gets his final warning. He just needs to find the control button on his aggression before the ref does it for him, Peter. Well, he's felt that, hasn't he? Ottavio is on to it in a flash. At a time. Ottavio going full tilt down the right-hand side. He is through here. Shapes to shoot! Big relief, it just needed better contact. All he'll be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. Uh, that's been intercepted. And it's Cristiano Ronaldo. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It is quite a game, breathless and latent. Well, it remains very delicately poised, and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. Portugal head into the half-time break with a narrow advantage. It is 2-1.
And please welcome our lads to the field. And that's the start of another 45 minutes. He's had it nicked away from him. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes, who's set up one goal so far. He's got away. Towering header. They've done it! And with that goal comes comfort. Well, there's always a chance of being caught like that when you surrender the football. And with that, the hat-trick is complete. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch and devastating in front of the goal. What a display. What a player. Number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. Portugal take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. That has the feeling of a breath of fresh air, Peter, and now they can fill their lungs and, and just... He's had a shot! Yes! And they are pulling clear here. Portugal clearly executed that with considerable confidence. It only took seconds to score once the ball was recovered. Four in the game. He is After the man. 50 minutes is number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. Portugal grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. Well, that's really winded the opposition. You can see their manager screaming on the touchline, telling his team to calm down. But they'll need to do that pretty quickly. It's composure from here. He's shifting through the gears. Up to meet it! No, not the best of headers. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo, and he's running through, he's through, it's one-on-one, -on -one. big chance! And somehow he's managed to miss it. Cristiano Ronaldo worked a lovely solo run and effort, Peter, he should go solo again for me. Otavio. He's left his man. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. Bernardo's point blank header. He got the hard part right, but the rest wrong. The attendance for the match was 80,113. Oh, it's been intercepted. He's found a way past. Gets away from his opponents. 
Ball swung. Climbs up big! He arrived on cue, but fluffed his line. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Christensen. And he's gone looking for safety. Fans delirious. This is utopian. Yeah, I'd call that transition with bite. They won it back and a bit hard. The goal score for Portugal after 65 minutes is number 21, Diogo Jota. It's become a case of men against boys. Delaney. Just eases him off the ball. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Ruben Diaz. Hoisted upfield by the keeper. Jota. It's a good run down the left-hand side. Oh, lovely bit of skill. Massive leap! It's in! And this is getting ridiculous. Borderline crazy. Well, it's a goal fest, and the fact that so one-sided now is, is getting scary. How many more does he want? After 69 minutes is number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. Portugal totally rampant here. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Defenders on the back foot. Ericsson. Look, they're prepared to be quite physical to contain any danger that might come their way. Octavio. The ball is loose, and the chase is on. Stands up to him well and emerges with the ball. Octavio has it in a wide position. Towering header! And that's past the post. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. And it's played forward, and that has left him in a heap. And it's Bernardo Silva. And Bernardo Silva! Oh, denied at the last. It was very much worth a try, and I've seen worse. That should... Tee him up nicely for his next attempt, at least. No, he's not getting his way this time. Great ball, and he's in here. Delaney. Good running with the ball. 
He's found a way through. That's the next one. And yes, it's there. And it adds further to a heavily one-sided scoreline. This is getting punishing. Well, I think we've reached the point when even damage limitations is, is no longer an option. Portugal, after 85 minutes, is number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. Christensen, Hoiberg, to Delaney, Paulson, Bruno Fernandes, now it's Diogo Jota, he is through here! bullied and it seems there is plenty more to come look all they want to hear right now is the final whistle they've been humiliated the goal score for Portugal after 89 minutes is number 10 Bernardo Silva Well, they're very oh, much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Vint. Bruno Fernandes goes steaming forward. He's got away. Great leap! It's a goal! And so clear that one side are so much better the scoreline entirely justified. Yeah, it has become ugly for one, but the other is still delivering beauty. For Portugal. Number seven, Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. He's found a way through. In towards the middle. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Portugal winners of a no contest. They just swamped their opponents in superior quality. Cristiano Ronaldo, very much the hero in this game. Your reflections then, Jim. Portugal had a very simple tactic to implement, Peter, and they exposed their opposition with expansive incision. And I just really liked what I saw here. So thank you very much, Jim, for joining me. That brings us to the end of our coverage. So from us both, a very good evening. A quick announcement today that memorabilia from today's match is now on sale.